Time's been moving slowly, so we are ready in to mm. yeah. Your eyes tell me that you don't Hello YouTube, my name is Kate and I'd like to thank you for returning to my channel uh, if you're new here, thank you for tuning in to my channel. Please like, subscribe, share, support. This is what I ask. We're here to motivate, encourage, and inspire. I have started my video with a little motivational thought to add. Also, tell me what you think. I have these random thoughts of what going on in the world or, or issues we want to discuss and thought about calling that corner that time real talk your opportunity to say and do whatever you want so I'm going to start with that on next week's vlog but now today we are going to be cooking I am going to make a crock pot recipe and a blueberry cake also I'm going to be going to Burlington to look for mirrors uh, a couple mirrors I need one for the studio and I'll show you the studio that I'm working on also we're going to be uh, hmm, going to breakfast have a breakfast date and have a lunch date so we're gonna be going there also also uh, what else we're gonna do well, we'll play that by ear. Come along. Baby, don't stop. Got the key to the lock. We in our own zone. Make yourself at home. Get to know mine on the inside. Can me to join next. Bye. 
out the prize, yeah Paradise, paradise I'm taking you Come and take a seat next to me, babe Let this pretty view take your breath away Baby, we deserve a break from our old ways Anywhere is home when you're with me Okay, this is the other mirror that I found at Home Goods. Let's go on my studio. And this is how my studio is coming out. Light in here. So I just got the new curtains and put my clothes here. My new lighting, my tripod. Well, fixing, getting ready to display my purses. And this will be my chair to do vlogging. I need an ottoman right here. And they have a white rug that I like, love. And so this is going to, so far so good. And then I will work on getting it a little better. Today we're going to do a crock pot recipe. It's called crock pot honey sesame chicken. So what I've done, it called for chicken breast. I'm using chicken thighs because I prefer it better. Uh, I put the chicken thighs in the crock pot, put a little black pepper in there. Right here I have about a quarter cup of sesame, I mean soy sauce, about, I'll give you the recipe at the bottom, some tomato paste, and a little water. Now, girl, got to put the eyes on, and y'all got to open up their glasses. Now, we're going to go with, I don't know, about a quarter. About a quarter cup of this is honey. I talked about doing honey from your area because it's better for you. So we're gonna do about a quarter cup of honey. That all. I have rice vinegar. Three tablespoons of rice vinegar. <clears throat> A little garlic. One teaspoon of sesame oil. And about a teaspoon of sriracha. Seasoning in there. Wait a minute. Gonna get us a little bit of our seasoning. You know I like my all shit, so we're gonna put a little bit of this in there. Oops. Put that on the chicken. And we're gonna mix this up. And pour it over the pour it over the chicken. Okay. 
Okay. We're going to put it on low. And we're gonna set it for about four hours on low. And that's it. Let that sit and we'll come back and check on it. Okay. Okay, now we're gonna take the chicken and we're gonna shred it up. Doing very, very easily. Take two parts, pull it apart. Then we're going to take a little cornstarch. Okay, a little cornstarch and water. Put it there, make a gravy. Stir this up. Cover it for another 20 minutes. And I'll be back right back with you. Okay, we're going to do a roasted broccoli smash garlic side dish for the chicken. So the chicken is still cooking. I cut up the broccoli. I'm gonna spray it with a little olive oil. Put a little salt and pepper in it. You have the oven set at 450 preheating. Put it on a baking sheet. Put a little bit more black pepper on here. And spray a little bit more olive oil. And then we're gonna put this in the oven for about 20 minutes. Alexa, stop. Okay. Oop, one of my lights are out. Now we have roasted. We have roasted broccoli for a side. Okay, YouTube. I am going to be doing a blueberry cake. Something for Fourth of July. Something a little out the ordinary. Something that's quick. Doesn't require a lot of work. Put it in the oven goes with just anything you're going to be cooking. If you're going to do hot dogs, you're going to do barbecue, you're going to do links, whatever. So right now I have one. This is only going to be for like six. So you can double it if you want, would like. Uh, one cup of sugar. Oh, my, excuse me. One cup of flour. One cup of flour. A teaspoon of baking powder and a half teaspoon of salt and an eighth of a teaspoon of cinnamon. That's what we started with so far. Then I need to get a half a cup of butter. OK. 
Okay. Then we're going to get three quarters of a cup of sugar. Three quarters of a cup of sugar. As you notice, I make my own vanilla. I may do another video. If you're interested in it, in it comment at the bottom if you'd like to see how to make vanilla. Okay, and we're going to we're going to do a small. We're going to whisk it, whisk this together. Okay, now we're going to take two eggs. Two eggs. Beat that. Mix this together. Increase the speed a little bit. Okay, then a little bit of lemon zest. Okay, you only need about a teaspoon of lemon zest. Mix. Okay, now we're going to put the flour mixture in. milk because it looks a little thick. You don't want it. I don't like that cake it's really thick. I like the more moist. Put a little almond milk in there. Okay. Then we're 
then we're going to put about two cups of blueberries. Okay. Okay, you take the blueberries, put a little flour on them, and a little bit of lemon juice, and it keeps them fresher longer. Okay, we're going to put it in a smaller dish, get you some parchment paper, spray it, put the blueberries in your mixture, fold it in there. Do not use the blender on it, fold it in there so they don't get all crushed up. Okay, that's how we fold it. Okay, then we're gonna dish it into our prepared pan. Now, the oven is set for 350. We preheated the oven for 350. in here you know, it's another hot day I tell you talk about heat index is 108 even after the rain okay We put this in here and we will put it in the oven for 45 to 55 minutes. Alexa, set timer for 50 minutes. And I'll be right back with you. Okay, took the blueberry cake out. Flip it. And there you go. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Remember to subscribe, like, and share. Comment on whether you'd like to see how I make the vanilla, or comment on anything you'd like to see. Additional things you'd like to see. See you soon. Yeah, you know what's up? Ain't nothing I won't do, I won't do for your body.